Hello and welcome back everybody, it's your boy G2K and we are here with some more Naruto Shippuden opening Storm 4. Yes, this game is amazing. Last time we took on part 1 and part 2 of the boys battlefield. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Clearly I did not get the S rank, so it kind of frustrated me. Which I'm going to go back and get everything S rank guys because I've done it before and I'll do it again. I'll get everything S rank on this game. But now we have in hell and it looks like Obito is going to be part of this mission and it looks exciting just just look at that artwork in the back it looks so so good i can't wait to do it and like i said we're going to finish naruto's part on top first before we even consider doing sasuke's in the bottom i think it just makes more sense because once we started this there was a boys battlefield part one boys battlefield part two it just makes sense to do things one at a time but yeah, thank you so much for watching the last two parts, guys. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying it just as much as I am. This series is going to blow us away because I'm telling you, Storm 4 is amazing. It's incredible. And yeah, our new series is going to be starting very, very soon. So please stay tuned for that because I know you're going to enjoy it and I'm going to enjoy it. But let's go ahead and start in hell. Yeah, if you could tell, I still got kind of like a little, a little bit of a cough, like a little dry cough. But I'm, I'm all good, guys. No more cold. Am I dead? Where am I? Somewhere halfway between life and death. Child of Uchiha. Your eyes. It can't be. You're from the Uchiha clan too? <laughs> well, if you can feel pain, it means you are still alive. So you saved me? Thank you. You can thank me later. You see, I intend to make you pay me back in full. Okay, what do I need to do? I need to get back to the Hidden Leaf Village. We're in the middle of a war. And now that I've finally awakened my Sharingan, I'll be much better at protecting my allies. Protecting your allies? What? You will not be able to go on working as a ninja with that body. Wake up. Nothing in this world goes the way it should. Would you shut up already? I don't want to stay here forever. <laughs> Enough. Neither of us can get out of here. Not with these bodies. Just who are you? I am the ghost of the Uchiha. Madara Uchiha. Uh, Madara? But Madara already died ages ago. Then I suppose I am a relic from the past. It is true. If I was not receiving a steady supply of chakra from that statue back there, I would be dead in an instant. I am cheating death. Why would you capture a half-dead kid like me? We are going to break the cycle of cause and effect. Create a world with only victors. With only peace. With only love. A world that contains nothing but those things. Why should I care? Look, I just want to go back to my village, okay? If you want to die, that is your choice. But I shall take that eye of yours before you do. Why do you want my eye? Y you already have your own! And I am still missing a right eye. The Sharingan's true power is unleashed. And the left and right come together, you see. So... That means if I stand shoulder to shoulder with Kakashi, I'll get even stronger. Then we'll really be able to keep Rin safe. Just another reason why I need to get out of here. Just wait, you two. I'm still alive. <laughs> I leave the rest to you. Thank <laughs> you. 
It's no use trying to act tough and hide your injuries. I've already seen them all. Green. <laughs> he said her name again. <coughs> Ook, what the heck are you doing? I just saw that you had started mumbling about Reen again, so I got curious as to what kind of dream you were having. He... He always looks like such a loser when he's doing that. It's quite funny. He even drools sometimes. <laughs> hey, quit laughing, Guru Guru. Sorry. <sighs> it's been a while since I first got here. The first time I saw you, I was scared to death. You're puppets who were created from the statue, right? To us, you look like the real puppet. Yeah, you're human, yet half of your body is artificial just like ours. Worried about Madara? He went on and on about breaking the cycle of cause and effect or whatever, and then he goes to sleep forever. Oh, didn't you understand what Madara was talking about? Basically, his idea is to chuck out all the bad stuff in the world and run away to a dream world where everything's good. Since it's a dream world, you can do whatever you like. You can even bring dead people back to life. What? Now that just sounds ridiculous. <laughs> Maybe to you. Shut up! You're way stupider than me. Bingo! <laughs> Jeez, I don't know if you're making fun of me or if you're the idiot. But I guess, I guess there's, there's no, no point, point in worrying about, about that, that now. now. I just I need to get, get used to this body, body as quickly as, as possible. possible. Come on, you guys, time to get to work. Okay, more rehab, right? I take it you're ready? Of course! All right. Let's fight! Wait, we're fighting Zetsus? Okay. Wow, the feet of a 40 white Zetsus, 70 white Zetsus. Okay, so this is kind of like the Kakashi one with the Lightning Blade or the Chidori at the time before it became called Lightning Blade. So let's go ahead and do this. Oh, training. And we got an arm now. Nice. Okay. Uh, Do we have Ninjutsu as well? I'm so... Okay. Uh, Maybe I should focus. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hold on. Oh, we do, we do, guys, we do. Hold on, look. Nice. Okay, we don't have enough chakra right now. <laughs> nope, nope. I think they're like two punch each. Yeah. Two punch. I did not remember this. Beware of white Zetsu's reinforcements. Okay, one is constantly creating more. Is that like the boss? Find the real uh triangle. There we go. There we go. Okay, so we basically need to take him out slowly, uh, eventually. For now, let's see if I can get these normal ones down. I just need to keep dodging. I've managed to survive so far by doing this slowly and dodging with jumps, which I never usually do. You never do that in a storm battle. Okay, so let me get to the edge. Let me gain some more chakra. And that's it. Very surprised. I did not remember doing this the first time around this game came out. But let's go ahead and go. Hi, hi, hi. Oh, he's coming back. He's coming back. We're going to have another quiz. We need to guess right. Okay. Uh, he is square. You basically need to find the one that looks like him because the other ones have slight differences, the head or whatever, and you just need to make sure you get the right one. Alright, let's go. I have managed to take no damage and I'm very proud of that. And every time that type of stuff happens, uh, I tend to mess up straight after, which is very frustrating. Oh yeah, he's taking damage. You can clearly see it. It's visible. He is... Oh, that is triangle. Almost got me there. Because they all had the same body, but their head was different. Nah, it definitely did some nice damage. Jump back. 
There we go. Get you. We done 40. Okay, that is nice. Did not expect us to do so many because I thought without Kakashi's uh, Chidori, um, we definitely wouldn't have done as many KOs as we did. Oh, he's there. We can finish you. We can finish you. Come here. Oh, he dead. He dead. He down. He down. He down for the count. He down for the count. Uh, let me get some more chakra. And then we can focus on the rest. There you go. Yeah, that's definitely going to drain the rest of my chakra. So I think that's the last one left. Yeah, that's it, right? Oh, I defeated 56. I didn't even get to the 70. I got an S rank for it, though. It feels good. I've gotten more used to it than before. I really feel at home in my body now. No more awkwardness. Rin, Kakashi, we'll be together again soon. Oh no! Huh? I just went outside for a minute and saw that Reen person you keep talking about. She's in serious trouble! What happened? She and that Kakashi guy are surrounded by a bunch of hidden mist ninja! <laughs> you still can't break that rock yet. But I've got to go help Reen and Kakashi. Where my body then? But you work for Madara, right? Are you sure you're all right with this? You want to help your friends, don't you? Thanks, Guda Guda. Okay. You are leaving? I'm grateful to you for helping me. But yes, I'm leaving now. I have to. Okay, take me straight there. Okay, leave the navigation to me. My allies are standing guard all over the world. It'll be a cinch. How does it look? Uh, pretty bad. They keep talking about hidden mist experiments. I don't really get it. But there are a couple of dozen of them surrounding Rin and Kakashi. What is Minato Sensei doing? Who? I said, what do you think you're doing, Yellow Flash of the Leaf? I think he's wrapped up in another mission. He's nowhere nearby. Just when we need him most. Kakashi, you promised. Please. You've got to protect Rain. I'll be right beside you soon. No, that's spray from the collision. Reen and Kakashi are in there. What's your plan? Isn't it obvious? I'm gonna charge straight in! <laughs> what the... <laughs> Why am I seeing things? There's no way that actually happened! Kakashi and I were supposed to... Protect her! going on what ah! 
<laughs> Back up. What an idiot. He's all alone. Take him out. <laughs> Damn, we're gonna go ham. We need to defeat at least 80 Miss Ninjas, 100 or 120. I I reckon I could do the 80. Uh, most cases I tend to do the the minimum or the, or the middle one because the last one always seems to be quite a, a fair amount of weight. Okay, find secret actions. Battles that feature the mark on the left have secret actions hidden in them. Perform certain actions in battle to unveil hidden action scenes. Okay, so I need to make sure I do those. Damn, okay then, Obito is going ham, oh my god, this is fun, this is definitely fun, oh, hey let's go, let's go, okay, secret action, oh snap, okay, I like that, definitely like that, Obito is going crazy, Obito, let's go, come on. Beware of the mist reinforcements. Yeah, I need I need to get some distance. Because I need to to heal for some chakra. Hold on. Let me get some more chakra in this. Oh snap. Yeah, okay, this is this is definitely fun. I really think they polished the mob battles in Storm 4. Because Storm 3 was really well done and I like the concept of mob battles and we only really got to do them with Sasuke. The fact that we've already had to do them with, um, with Kakashi and Obito, we've got them to do it again with Obito throughout this, we're on the, what, the, the boys battlefield and on this Hell's mission. Okay, let's clear these ones that are here and then we can make our way to the other side. Damn, okay, I took some damage, but yeah, Obito, let's go. I don't have chakra like that. Hold on. Secret action again complete. Hold on. Do it again. Nice. There we go. Okay, so these are the secret actions. I need to keep doing them. Well, not all of them, because I need to start doing some different ones. Let's see if I go... Okay, no, hold on. Another one coming, I think. Yeah, yeah, definitely another one coming. Nice. Oh. This is dangerous. Okay, I've done the 80. Oh, another one. Okay. I was about to say, I thought there was um something else coming there, but it looks like it was just a little thing. We've done all the secret actions, which is pretty cool. So I don't need to stress about them anymore. We've managed to surpass the 80 that I'm pretty sure that we would. Can we hit the 100 barrier that we was aiming for? Because I don't get where the others are, re um, the reinforcements are coming. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. Oh, is, is more coming now? Oh, no, no, just the 89. I get it. I'm in hell. Nothing in this world goes the way it should. <laughs> Since it's a dream world, you can do whatever you like. You can even bring dead people back to life. Rain, we'll be together again. I'll make a world where we can be together again. I'm going to break the cycle. That's why I decided to come back. Do you think that anyone saw you? I'm the only witness. Obito annihilated every last one of them. But it looks like he spared Kakashi. He was unconscious though, so he didn't see anything. Still attached to your old ally, are you? No. I just didn't care about him. It doesn't matter to me whether he lives or dies in this world. He'll 
join us in the new world we create. And so will Reen. Madara, show me how to create the dream world. You do not need to thank me anymore. This way, as of today, you are our savior. The dream world is extremely simple to create. All you need to do is take everyone into the Genjutsu world I have created. But you need to use the moon to magnify the scale of the Jutsu. Yes, let us see. First, I need to educate you about the Sage of the Six Paths and the Ten Tails. And then, about my project, Tsukinome. In a previous battle, I obtained some of Hashirama's DNA and transplanted it into my own body. And then, when I was on the brink of death, I awakened my Renegon. At the same time, I also broke a certain seal. I summoned the ghetto statue, the empty vessel of the Ten Tails from the moon. Then, I quickly used the statue as a medium to cultivate more of Hashirama's DNA. The result was this. <laughs> I transferred my will into these beings. They are half me. Now get to work until I can be reborn. You are Madara Uchiha. That was a really, really fun episode, guys. I don't know about you, but um, the backstory was a everything that we needed to clarify and kind of get an understanding of where Obito got his drive. Like I said, we only got managed to do the first objectives for both, but we managed to get S ranks, which is more important. So we've also got Obito Berserk as a player character, which is definitely fun. Uh, so what is unlocked next? So another side of the story in story mode you can also enjoy side story episodes side stories have no effect on completing the actual chapter so feel free to access them whenever you like please take uh time to complete all the side stories so that you can enjoy the story even more okay so we've unlocked a new episode unlocked you can now play a pitch black world and the battle intensify so a pitch black world that's probably the side story is going to be just a little flashback to where he fought his sensei Minato and then this one is going to go back to the current battle which we're at now which is actually going to be kind of fun so I think I'm going to leave the current battle for after but I might take on a pitch black world just to make things a little bit more interesting but that was a really good episode in my opinion like I said we got to do two mob battles uh, we got to get used to the young Obito and then the, the bloody half half Obito which took part of the, the skin or the Zetsu and he went insane. He he uh, unlocked his manga queue at the same time. Uh, Reen died. Uh, got to see a little bit more backstory there. A lot of clarification going on. But definitely a, a five star episode in my opinion. Definitely. So we're going to go do uh, a pitch black world. And then we can end off this episode for today. But let's see. Hidden Leaf Assault. So yeah this is probably going to be a replay of what we've done in like Storm 3. But I kind of like that they've done it as like a flashback for this. Do you want it? I'm going to extract the Nine Tails from you and cross the leaf. Now, come on out, Nine Tails.
Did you notice me? And you're done for. He got away so fast. My old sensei is still powerful. But I'm faster now. Shall not escape. Who are you? Why are you attacking the leaf? What good would it do if I told you? You'll all be finished in no time anyway. There's no hope for you. Damn. Okay, so this time I kind of like it. We get to do the opposite. Um, thing that happened in Storm 3 when we was the fourth Akage Minato going up against Obito. Now we get to do the opposite, which is kind of cool. So let's see how this goes. Not a boss fight, uh, battle this time as well, but come on Minato. You've got to give me a better fight than that. Let's go. Let is go. Okay, I did that was the down combo. Let's go for the up combo again. Let's see. Nice. Okay, down combo. I want to see everything properly. Uh, we don't have an ultimate Majusu just yet. Okay, snap. Uh, let's do a normal combo. Let's go, let's go, let's go. No, almost there. Yeah, we don't let him use his Rasengan. No way. Ooh, okay. I'm actually liking this Obito. We, we managed to do the 20 hit combo. I didn't even see the objectives this time around. But, oh, nice. Okay. Come on, let's finish him. That was pretty easy, I can't lie. But I'm, remember, it's early on in the game. These type of games tend to progress in the difficulty as you go on. Is the village distracting you or the children? Either way, since you can't seem to concentrate on the battle, you're going to die. I won! God. Flying writing, level two! I expected no less of you, Fourth. You actually managed to damage me. But in the end, everything will bend to my will. I shall rule this world. There are plenty of ways to go about it. The Nine Tails came out completely uncontrolled. Is that a problem? The Hidden Leaf has been completely devastated. For a while, they'll be too busy fixing up the village to do anything else. I see. And while they're distracted, we move. We have a lot to prepare for Project Tsukinomi. We could do with the great nations looking the other way for the time being. Let's go. This world is pitch black. Mina 
Ito Sensei. I'm sick of this. I don't care. About this world anymore. That was a little, little, um, <laughs> I know it was a little, uh, a nice little side story there. So we didn't do land ninja to attack three times. We managed to land it once, but we got the, the 20 hit combo and the 50% health. And we got another S as well, which is great. That means now we can finally continue on with the main bits of the story. I'm assuming we can't do that little point at the end. Like you got one here, got the next one, the one all there on the right. We can't do that until we've then done Sasuke's. But we're going to take on the next one and potentially the one after that. On the next episode hopefully you guys enjoyed today we did in hell which is obito's little backstory and we had the little um the different side of the story from what we did in storm 3 as us playing as obito going up against minato in the pitch black world so hopefully you guys enjoyed that and look forward to the next episode and where we will be doing the battle intensifiers Madara appears i feel like everything's going to start kicking off very 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 soon things have to be honest because we've done the nice flashbacks and we're starting to get used to the new style of mob battles and we're getting used to the new combos being able to switch with different people and i'm really enjoying the game so far hopefully you guys are too and you're looking forward to the next episode but you know i like to always say at the end of every episode thank you so much for the love and support you guys are showing keep doing what you're doing i appreciate it so much it's helping the channel grow and like i said our attack on titan series if you guys haven't seen it is literally coming to an end so don't forget to watch that and when it does end we have a big 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 new series coming and i hopefully you guys are looking forward to that it's a brand new game I think everyone's been looking forward to it. It's, a, it's the first new anime game, really, to be honest, that has been released in the last, what, maybe two years. So everyone stay tuned and look forward to that. But this is your boy G2K, and I'll see you guys next time.